Yo, welcome back to Nick and Corey. My name's Nick. And I'm Corey, and this is Halloween season. So, you know, if you watch our channel, we've been doing a lot of horror movies. So Lots today, of spooks. Yeah, we're we doing got another, some eye bleach for you today. We're doing another horror movie today. It's called Coco. <laughs> uh, oh my God, it's Pixar. <laughs> you see that dog? That is nightmare fuel. No, it's not. Are you kidding? It looks like a sponge with teeth. Are you blind? Are you going blind? It's like a hot dog sponge. A hot dog sponge? Yeah. What is this? I don't know, dude. Those what, paws. Stay off the mat. Throw on me. Throw stay on off me. the mat. Throw on me for loop. Anyways, we hear that Coco is a uh, rather scary movie. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna get a little dranky drank on. We take a shot every time Coco is tear jerking. Every time he makes us cry. Tear jerking sounds like. That is a common term. You do not need to make it, it sound, weird. Sounds. Don't make it weird. Sounds sus. Don't need to make it weird. No, so we, we hear that there's some wholesome moments and we don't get many of those around here, down around these no. parts now. This, is, this is some bleach for you guys. Yeah, so we're gonna we're gonna be uh, crying and drinking. In Disney's Pixar Extraordinary Adventure, a boy who dreams of becoming a great musician embarks on a journey to uncover the mysterious, uh, the mysteries, behind his ancestors' stories and traditions. Now that's a pretty boring description. <laughs> uh, this is hey, 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 do you like this movie? Well, uh, suck it. <laughs> this is about Dia de los Muertos, which is, <laughs> is it? Mexico's, uh, Halloween. I think but it's, it's called not. Day of the Dead. Ex yeah. Excuse it's, moi. It's, Look at all these doilies. I don't know what the going on now. A doily? Yeah, I, I think that's what it is. Or these placemats, I don't know. He and his family would sing and dance and count their blessings. One of those things is not like the others. Dancing. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you know, my, my daddy was a musician. He used to sing and dance and pay his taxes. <laughs> What was unique about him? <laughs> he actually paid his taxes. <laughs> his dad left? Damn, he went out for cigarettes with his guitar? Wow. She didn't have time to cry over that one boy musician. Whoa, this whole story is told through quilts? It's not, that's not a quilt, it's like a napkin. This whole story is told through handkerchiefs? I don't know what they are. They're, like, there's like napkins, but they have holes in them. It's very ineffective napkins. Would you like our full napkin or our napkin with holes? Not made to save the environment. Would you like our premium napkins or our regular napkins? <laughs> As her family grew, so did the business. Wow, recruiting your family with slave labor. That's what we like to see. <laughs> you know, that's, that's what they do in other countries. I think oh, it, you're eight? You're time to work for the family. I think it's child labor. I don't know if you can overlap child labor and slave labor. They're the, they're the same thing. I, I know it's like not all squares are rectangles, but all rectangles, wait, no. All squares are rectangles, but not all rectangles are squares. Yeah. So are all child laborers slave labor as well? Yes. But not all slave laborers are child laborers. Exactly. Okay. Mama Precisely. Mama. Oh, she Coco's is the mom. She is a raisin. How are you, real? Oh, she's adorable. That is a gilf if I've ever okay, seen one. Okay, so she's already dead in the mind. No music. Oh, they hate music because the grandfather ran away. No music! And he wants to be a musician. This is going to be a tough struggle. Oh my god. No music! That's like my mom. No gaming! This is a demon dog. That dog has less brain cells than teeth. The way they animate this dog's skin is just unnatural. It looks like a ball sack. But when he played music, he made people fall in love with him. I mean, guitar players do swoon some, but oh my God, this guy's a dad. <laughs> this guy's an actual father. I like how he's in movies and all he does is play guitar while wearing different outfits. He's Elvis. It's like The Rock. Like The Rock is himself in every movie he's in. Yeah. This guy's Mexican Elvis. He lived the kind of life you dream about. He f ladies and he, ha he was And poor. he had money? And he had money. Until 1942. No. Oh my like God. He was crushed by a giant Shot. bell. That is depressing. <laughs> my guy just got wasted. The 1942. It's gonna make me cry of laughter. Dude, this guy got killed by a bell. Is dinner ready? Ding, 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 and no! Not my, my grandpa died of bells. Uh, and, the, and the grandpa's telling the story. And this is how Taco Bell was founded. <laughs> this is like the opposite of this family where it's like, no music. He ran away because he wanted to be a musician. <laughs> oh, this guy's grandkids like, no bells in the house. <laughs> Look, if I were you, I'd march right up to my family and say, hey, I'm a musician. Deal with it. Hey, I'm going to be poor and you're going to have to deal with it. I feel like this guy's he did that and his family kicked him out. That's why he's living on the street. No, this guy's getting his shoes shined. He's important. By, by a kid. That's cow? child labor. No. Yeah, but it's okay in Mexico. Is that also slave labor? Yes. <laughs> uh, squares and rectangles. Miguel! <gasps> oh my god, the raid boss. Her spidey sense is tingling. This is, this is the- Are you touching a guitar? <laughs> Hit him with the shoe? La chancla. Dude, I'm telling you, being raised by a foreign family, right? I mean, that sounds weird. Being in an immigrant family 
The grandmother is the most intimidating person possible. That's his mom. No, it's not. Shame on you. <laughs> he was showing me his guitar. His Dude, what? This, this, this movie makes him seem like a pervert. It's yeah. Like, you were showing him your what? In public? What the fuck? Someone get your the Your guitar? You, you, you made- La policia! <laughs> Dude, I love that she's a ninja with the- Look at- watch it. He wants no part of your music, Mariachi. You keep away from him. <laughs> <laughs> Did you see that? <laughs> Coco is basically furniture. <laughs> Human furniture. Actually, that's a thing, by the way. Oh, that's a that's a kink, though. No, no, not kink. No, I think this is actually in Latin cultures. They uh they prop their dead up in the oh, corner. Oh, I thought the... you meant like using someone as like your footstool. No. Oh, well, different, different maybe. wavelengths. Well, maybe. maybe. But no, in 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 uh, Latin cultures or some cultures, I think they actually have their dead like propped in the corner after they die. At, at the wake. turn into furniture. Oh, so the dead are like um, what's it called? I'm Taxidermy? trying to educate the audience, and you're making so the, it about uh, sex. <laughs> the dead are taxidermy, but they're, they're not, also furniture. Can you imagine you come to? I mean, what is taxidermy people besides <laughs> embalming? You, you tell you tell your family it's like, uh, yeah, grandma passed away, and, and they ask, it's like, oh, what's she gonna be now? Oh, I'm actually turning her into my cupboard. That's what they do. That's. They embalm the body and they leave them in the corner of the room, and then the and people have the wake, and you come in and you like say like goodbye to the body. It's like an open casket, but like advanced open casket. <laughs> I was just, Papa, Papa is home. Mama. Ah, uh, poor old Coco. Poor little Coco, she has no idea what's going on. She's talking about the guy who ran away. Yeah, she has no idea what's going on. <laughs> exactly. Oh, Oh, I'm that's gonna depressing. Cry. That's so. De Alzheimer's is depressing. I don't think it's Alzheimer's. That I is think, Alzheimer's, dude. Brother. I think she's just so out of it that she doesn't know what's going like that's on. That's Alzheimer's, my guy. No, that Alzheimer's to, is both. To confusing grandparents. She can't even open her eyes. Dude, this ball sack dog is gonna bother me the whole movie. I, like I can tell it. It looks like a sack and a half. It's just so <laughs> wriggly. It is. Ah, uh, it looks like wet dude, but it's, dry. It's its ribs too. Whoever made this. <clears throat> Ball sack, McGee. He's a good sidekick though, cause he's just a blob. Sacco the dog. Is he making his own guitar? Someone wanted to hear me. That's impressive. That's... I'm, I built my first guitar out of paper clips and stick of glue. It's a paper mache guitar. Damn, he has wow. an entire throat. This is idolize. like what I used to see in TV shows in like the 90s. You have a, a, a whole ass, uh, what are they called? Altar. A to, like, whole ass? Yeah, a whole ass. Pause. Alter for their love in high school. You'd have the creepy person who have like, oh, the worshiping. I am in love with the cornerback of the football team. He will be mine. I, I have his hair. Here's my voodoo doll that I've made of him. I he, touch it. He uh, watches me play with myself. He will watch me in person one time in the future when I kidnap him. That is that that sounds like a girl that would commit and, rituals. And make him mine. <laughs> All it will take is a little chloroform. This is sus though. Like I, I understand it like at admiring someone and be like, oh my God, they're my idol. But like, this is a lot. No, this is standard. Dude, action figure, poster, TV show, photo, Dude, people do action like, figure. Uh, what's his name? Um, What's the famous soccer player? Why, is, why am I thinking Tarantino? It's Cristiano Ronaldo. Uh, they're so similar, I understand. Yeah, <laughs> Ronaldo, Tarantino, very similar. Who does, th no, that's people weird. People idolize them. Yes, like athletes. That's weird. No. Weird. You're weird. They probably idolize professional Super Smash players. Listen, I idolize myself. Oh my myself. God, Hungrybox, I wanna be just like I you. I put myself on a pedestal. That's cause you are like a, a narcissistic queen. donkey. We've all decided it's time you joined us in the world. We have a Yay. wonderful idea. You are officially- Shot labor. Yeah. yeah. How old are you, Miguel? You are eight? <laughs> oh, I started my first full-time job and I was six. You are starting late, my friend. Back when your great-great-grandmother made this business, she was only a single mom and your great-grandmother, she was three. And you know what she did? She made her the shoes. She spit shine the shoes. You are too old to not be making the shoes, so make her the shoes. It's time to live up to your family name, Mr. Shoe Boy. We'll pay you in spit and hugs like <laughs> family does. Now get over into the shop. <laughs> <laughs> this kid just looks like someone just gave him a pile of dog shit for Christmas. Yeah. This is depressing. Is. Your parents setting expectations on you to do something that you don't want to do is depressing. You are a Vera. You can do anything you want I mean, so long as what you want is to make shoes. <laughs> <laughs> to be fair though, they probably gave birth to him for free labor. That is what people with children do. Is he gonna learn that Ernesto de la Cruz is his dad? 
Bum, 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 bum. Holy shit, my friend. Guitar? Del Cruz is your dad? Papa. Pa <laughs> she only can say one word. Papa. Wait, so he is her, her husband? Or is that his actual dad? No, it's great great grandfather or some shit. Is it? I feel bad for that this situation, but it's like this lady can't see and she only knows how to say papa now. So like she might not even see the photo. She sees a potato she's on just, the ground. She's pointing. Papa! And she's like, what it actually is Papa this time. I'm gonna be a musician. <laughs> Damn, they snuffed his ass out. Wow. Crazy fantasy. It's not a fantasy. <laughs> Stop filling his head with crazy fantasies, like not mm -hmm. making shoes. <laughs> he will make shoes and he will like it. She was his wife. You want to end up like that man? He's like, no more music. And the kid's like, just listen to me play. Like, I'm really good. No more music. And he starts playing. And the grandma's like, F you. Oh. <laughs> Bitch. Is she going to smash it? I swear to God, if you smash it, grandmother, I will scream. <gasps> no! no! Not his paper mache guitar. No! This f***ing bitch, dude. I'm taking a shot to that. That's f***ing depressing as shit. He made it out of cardboard and tears. No, come. You feel better after you eat with your friends. You are wow. an asshole. We in this family. Such toxic behavior from mama. Toxic grandma mimity. Oh, oh that's my sacrilegious. God. It is his bloodline. What is that's not the same. That's like saying I'm gonna take a piss in the White House because my great 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 grandfather may have been related to someone who was a slave <laughs> in the White House. It's just slightly different. Ooh, he timed it with the explosion. This kid's a true uh, warrior. Breaking. Sneaky boy. And entering. Will Ernesto's ghost be summoned and guide him? There's some like little fairy flakes there, yeah. <gasps> of course he is. His grave. Dude, that would take like, so much energy to move. Him just popping You don't know up. how well lubed it is? He's like five pounds, maybe six. Whoa. Our family thinks music is a curse. It is. To be fair, he got a bell that fell on him. That's not exactly a happy ending. I'm gonna play in the plaza, just like you did. Damn. I don't know what that means, but uh, that was powerful. There's some magic going on. I'm sorry. It's not what it looks like. De La Cruz is like. <gasps> Nobody here. Huh? Huh? Did he just get ghosted? I'm going ghost. Did he just ghost himself? Did he just Danny Phantom? Let me help. She got bones. Oh, oh shit. So he's in the realm of the undead now. These are pretty friendly looking skeletons. They're, they're wholesome undead. Do you mind? <gasps> they're like, ah, skin. Oh, he's alive, but he's not. Ah, someone with a, a not zero hip to waist ratio. <laughs> zero, infinite. <laughs> October leaves? Dante? Yeah, it's Dante? orange leaves. Oh, so this dog's just dead dead. This dog's been dead the whole time. Has it? <laughs> I don't know. God damn, that's sick. What is this cyberpunk shit? Oh my God. This is like a mariachi cyberpunk. What is going on here? It, this is like an MC Escher painting. I cannot make out it's what's so happening. It's so cool. This is so sick. Huh, and there was a skull in the background. <laughs> <laughs> that is a dead child. They're pointing at a living kid like, ew, what's that? No, that was a child that was dead. Yes, children die. That's not cool. Why would you put that in a movie? Okay, when I said I was Frida, just now, that was a lie. And I apologize for doing that. No photo on an ofrenda. What is this, an afterlife passport? Yeah, I guess. Oh, he did Bamboo's the over-under. Under. Is he not going to be able to make it? Just further. So if you're not given the green light, you just get consumed? If this happens, why even have the TSA agents in the first place? It seems like a pretty well-made defense. They can't get through? Why they can't? Because no one cares about them. Oh, so if you have to put up a picture to give somebody a- uh, To bring them back. A passage. So what's gonna happen is this kid's not gonna have a photo put up because no one thinks he's dead. And he's not gonna be able to cross back. And then eventually he will die and- uh, then... Jaw dropping. <laughs> I get it, because his jaw fell off his face. You think a skeleton uh, would give good uh, sloppy? Think about it. Well, you're cursed. What? Uh, Dia de los Muertos is a night to keep to the dead. You stole from the dead. Why is this dog here? He looks like a hyena. A sausage someone dropped in I'm the telling you, he looks like a, a ball sack. He does look like a sausage boy. Get your family's blessing and everything should go back to normal. 
but you gotta do it by sunrise. Oh, he actually dies. Makes sense. Because he stays in the Shadow Realm. So he's racing against time to not perma die. Where have I seen this story before? This feels very similar to something that's happened. I give you my blessing to go home and to never play music again. What? She can't do that. Well, that's f dude. Even his dead family's betraying him. What's so her back? Yeah, because they gave him his blessing again. So I guess as soon as he touches music again, he's going to turn back into a ghost. Probably. But it's to him, music is worth dying for. And, and he's going to take it again. do it. Yeah, oh. right back. Two seconds and you already. <laughs> <laughs> Instant. It's my life. You already have yours. Oh, oh shit. Yes, I say dead, burn, bitch. But you're already dead. Fleeing an officer. Falsifying a unibrow. That's illegal. Falsifying a unibrow. Falsifying a unibrow is fantastic. That, can you imagine you're in a prison, you're being tried by the judge? Uh, you're not in prison. Just you're making up bullshit. Um, what what here, am I in for, judge? Uh, well, you shat your pants. Oh, yeah, I did. Real good. I shat them real good. You, uh, you used forks with soup, which is not really a criminal offense, it's just frowned upon. <laughs> I like to live on the edge, you know what I mean. You raw-dogged animals? I did Goats, not, specifically? I, I, did, I did not do that. <laughs> that is slanderous <laughs> and mischievousness. It says- That you, is lascivious. You, you used corn as a dildo? I did do that, I did do that. Is it rib for pleasure? Does this, Man, this guy have got some fancy. He's the only one that can like make is his bones Is he Ernesto do. secretly? Wait. No way. He's someone important. But he's the only one using his bones in like a way that's different than everyone else. Yeah, he's a talented boner. <laughs> that's what she said. <laughs> so I'm letting you off with a warning. But if you impersonate the unibrow one more time. He doesn't have shoes. I don't what, do you, what do you get sentenced to? 25 to Listen, if you're in the afterlife, it's probably important. Well, maybe this isn't such no, a no, 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 no. I can help you. You can help me. We can help each other. But most importantly, you can help me. But more importantly, you can help me. This guy's out for himself. He's oh, a yeah, shitter. A con artist. I need my spirit guide. Pepita. Pepita? What is this? A that does one? not look like a Pepita to me. It's, it's like a Hispanic version of a griffin. It's like a panther. I don't know if I would ever call that Pepita. That's a monster. That's like calling a dragon Billy. You want to see my pet cat? I, it's, I named her Trudy. You want to say hi to Trudy? <laughs> She's Trudy, really Trudy. sweet. She only weighs 60,000 pounds and has the bite force to crush steel. It's like a saber tooth mammoth. Yeah. <laughs> With wings. <laughs> okay. Eh, ta da. That is the doorknob. Is, is that. <laughs> That's a very you're gonna, effective. You're gonna you're probably get upset with this. Is this racist to like no. skull face? Oh, notice his fingers are turning back into the bone. Yeah, of course they are. Is is this offensive to the skull people that he is putting on a face for the skull face? I don't think this is um, what do you call that? This this would be dead face. Yeah, is he is it dead facing? You know anything about this party? It's the hot ticket. But if you're not on the guest list, you're never getting in. Chorizo. You just call him a Does it mean pork? Yeah, sausage. Oh no, did he die by sausages? He, he choked on a sausage? I'm taking a shot to that. That's incredible. I didn't choke, I was gorking. It's uh, different. I didn't choke, somebody forced it down my throat. It was a glory hole in a time of weakness, okay? <laughs> Death by sausage. Buenas noches, chicharron. I don't want to see your stupid face. Hector. Yeah. As I figured, nobody likes Hector. <laughs> Oh, oh. What is what is he suffering from? Fade. I'm fading, Hector. I can fade. Because no one remembers him? Take this scene out of context this is what every person says when they're too high. I'm, I'm fading, fading, Hector. I can feel it. <laughs> you play me something. No, you you know I don't play anymore, Cheech. Huh? If you wanna be my lover, you gotta play my guitar. <laughs> oh my favorite Hector. <laughs> Hector has to be related to Ernesto somehow. It's like his yeah, brother or something. It's probably part of the family. Watch this guy was actually his great grandfather. Well, That's actually Ernesto. It might not even be Ernesto. Know. He probably like, doesn't even know that Ernesto is part of his family. Like it might be a, a, a loophole where like this guy's actually his grandfather and Ernesto is like just a red herring. Oh, um, could be. The fact that this guy plays guitar makes me think he, he's bumped up on the list. Also the oh, fact yeah. that he's a vagabond and he left his family. True. Knuckle 
clothes they drag on the floor. Those are the words. There are children present. Oh, they said some darky words in there. Narcos they drag on the floor? Is it supposed to be somebody on all fours, like doggy style? I, I don't know what the words are, but something's supposed to be in there. Oh god, the skeleton's gonna fade away and die. What is this song about? If I wasn't so ugly, she'd give me a chance. And that's his favorite song. <laughs> that is depressing as Shot to that. Yeah. You know my favorite song <laughs> is the one that goes, if I weren't so ugly, then I'd maybe I'd have a girl. <laughs> is he gonna fade away? No. No femurless man. No! Wait, what happened? He's been forgotten. And there's no one left in the living world who remembers you. That is, that is a thing. You, you die twice in this life. Once when you die, and the second time when you were forgotten. forgotten. Our memories, they have to be passed down by those who knew us in life, in the stories they tell about us. This is a good moral. This is a, this is a really cool way to teach the tradition yeah. of Dia de los Muertos. You wanna take that away? You'll never understand. Why can't she just say, go play music? She's La Llorona. No. Is Ernesto his hus her husband? I have no idea. This family is confusing to me. I thought... Suddenly, there was... Okay, so Coco oh. was Ernesto's daughter? I forgot this movie was called Coco for a second. She made a sacrifice to get what we wanted. Now you must make a choice. But... I don't give a f about my family. Give me music. He's only like eight. Why does he have to pick anything? Shoes and family or music and happiness. Let him play music for at least like another six, eight years. He doesn't have to work until then. Oh, well, he does. Then, then again, there's child labor in this movie. Exactly. So, yeah. His child labor time is up. Yeah. He should have been working about three or four years ago at this point. <laughs> He's late to the to the shop. That was kind of sad. I just don't have a reason to drink. You're ruining my life. It's not fair. He's too talented for not having played that much. Yeah, I know. This is like what happens when you play a video game that's paid to win and someone just comes in and uh, the entire this game. This is teaching people unrealistic expectations. <laughs> yeah. You'll never be this good at anything in your life no matter how hard you try. Give up! <laughs> oh, he's been playing to the TV the whole time. <laughs> he fell in the water. Oh, he's gonna lose his makeup. Oh, and they're gonna realize he's the living kid. Grandson. I have a great great grandson. Well, you see, bells. Bells are scary. I don't want you to succumb to the curse of the bell. He's like, the Taco wanna, Bell. I want to be a musician just like you did. You want to die to a bell? <laughs> you probably should want to live a little bit more than that. <laughs> the curse of the bell. Is that how you got in here? Is that why you're dead? You died to a bell? Like me? With a talent like yours? How could I not listen? Oh, daddy is wholesome. I have a great, great grandson. This feels too easy. Yeah, we're only halfway through the movie. Some stuff's gonna happen. Great, great grandson. My great, great grandson. He's alive and a musician. This is all grandparents. Yeah. Here. This have is you, my property that I made. This is, I made you, not directly, but I gave directly. I gave, I invested in you. Poor Yuzi. No, I did all my own stunts. Oh, I have to say okay, so it's rushing to the happiness so you can get to the sadness. Yeah. One cannot deny who one is meant to be. And you, my great great grandson, are meant to be a musician. And your family will never love you. And you will die to a bell, just like me. My friend, you're, you're being forgotten. And whose fault is that? Hector, please. Those were my songs you took. Oh shit, he wrote all the music. He's the ghostwriter. Oh no, this is depressing. We made a great team, but you died and I wanted to keep a part of you alive. Oh. Stealing from his right hand! Wow. Remember the night I left? That was a long time ago. Wait, so together. he died from a bell and he died choking on a sausage. This, there has to be some some connection here. I don't I don't think there was. But in the movie, Don Hidalgo poisons the drink. Poison. He poisoned him. Imagine murdering someone and then putting it in a movie you made. <laughs> <laughs> it's been done. I guarantee it. This is like Mike, uh, not Mike Tyson. OJ Simpson writing the book. Yeah, if uh, I did it, if I would have, if I was a murderer or something, if I did it, yeah. I thought it must have been something I ate. Perhaps it was that chorizo, my friend. Or something I... That chorizo. Oh, so he didn't choke. He poisoned him? Wow. You poisoned me? You're confusing movies with reality, Hector. 
You jumped a lot of conclusions there. Why did you have to kill him to get the book? Just take the book. You took everything away from me! <laughs> you rats! <laughs> he actually poisoned him, that's the question. I believe it. They showed a flashback and all. That's sad. Sad man. He didn't actually die sucking on a glory hole chorizo like they said he did. No. no. He died sucking on his best friend's chorizo by leaving him and drinking poison. That made no sense. That was going nowhere. <laughs> I guess shot to your uh, best friend slash co-writer killing you. Yeah, he got that sloppy toppy, but not in the good way. Yeah, the the sloppy droopy, the droopy toppy, <laughs> the dead slop. My reputation, it is <laughs> very important to me. He's gonna poison him too. <laughs> well, just to be sure, would you like to have a toast to me? What, he's keeping the photo? My blessing? Security! Wow. wow! Why is this movie called Coco? I, I'm very confused <laughs> why it's called Coco. At what point did Coco was the main character? That was evil, dude! This guy's an evil piece of shit! Why do they have a giant, like, well dungeon? It's like the opposite of a lava pit. Yeah. Is there sharks in it? Why do you have this in the afterlife? Because he's an evil villain. At what point did you make this be like, Shot mm, to killing at, at some point in the afterlife, I will have to keep someone here against their will. Yes. Build, is... build it, my child slaves. My undead child slaves. This is what an evil villain does, dude. You were right. I should have gone back to my family. Hey. Hey, they, hey. they told me not to be like De La Cruz. And of course De La Cruz can't be his grandfather because that would mean that you can't have evil people in your family. That's just wrong. It's like you can't have evil people in your family. Your family's always right. So this guy's in his family. That guy's his great-grandfather. You think this is his great-grandfather, Hector? Absolutely. When did Hector sneak into that poon? I wish I could tell her that her papa was trying to come home. My Coco. Oh! Oh, they said the name of the movie! Oh my god, devastating! Shot, shot, heart broken, slapped on table. Tears! Let's take a toast. Tears all over my face! Please. Is this safe? No, it's not. Point talking in your eyes, not safe? No. Okay. So do it. Okay. Tears. Ah! <laughs> That was way more than I expected. That's what she said. Take the shot. <laughs> oh god, I feel like someone just in my eye. Is this the troubles girls go through? That's my mama Coco. That's my mama Imelda. How are they both mamas? They just say mama. For any tier of mama? Yep, any tier. They got great mama and great 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 mama. Family? Called it because I'm a genius. So can he send him I'm, back? I'm a Genius. Listen, listen. Oh, he needs to get the photo back from Ernesto. Wow, they have everything that they could ever want. But not the photo. Oh, true. Even if I never got to see Coco in the living world, I thought at least one day I'd see her here. Give her the biggest hug. Oh, you would be forgotten before she dies. Well, because she's forgetting. How does that work when the only person who remembers you dies? Is there like- never get to see him. Well, is there an overlap? No overlap. You fade before they die. Interessante. Also, what version of you goes to this afterlife? Like, what do you mean? like when Coco oh, dies, does she go to the afterlife we as like the old everyone. crotchety like grandma Probably who can't not. move, or does Probably she get to be her self. young, or does she go to as like a kid? Remember me, though I have to say goodbye. This is f depressing, dude. This is actually sad. Okay, this scene's this scene's hitting me. In this the, scene is this scene is sadness that away. This one's hit me in the feels. I'm too a dad drunk who, and alone to feel these things. Dude, the dad wanted to come home to visit her, but he Not couldn't even visit. because he just wanted to go home, home, and then he died. Sucking Ernesto on them killed Torinos, Torinos, Torizos. You know what I mean. To the deathly sausage. Harry Potter and the Deathly Sausage. Oh god. This scene's it's too long. It's lasting too long. Oh, the feels are building. The, face, the, man. I'm about the to feels cry. are here. I don't like it. I don't like feeling these no, things. No, he's fading. You need to go. Fuck. Stop you making me feel back. things in my emotional hole. My organ is atrophied, and you're making me feel things. You should be the one the world remembers, not De La Cruz. I didn't write "Remember Me" for the world. I wrote it for Coco. And now she can't remember anything. Irony. So if your last person that remembers you has Alzheimer's, it literally kills you in the afterlife? I guess. You just suddenly vanish. I'm proud to be his family! 
I, the whole whooping. This little chihuahua call? I, I don't know what the point of that is. Wholesome. Wholesome, let's go. He sounds like goofy. He's like, oh, the kid just sounds like a dog. He's like, ow, 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 ow. He's a little chihuahua. Sure, why not? Wait, so Amelda is Hector's like wife. granddaughter. No. Is it? No, Imelda is his wife. Oh, she was it? holding Coco. Oh. Coco's her daughter. Dante! You knew he was my papa Hector the whole time! You are a real spirit. Dante's guy. stupid though. He, he kinda looks like the fucking hyena from Lion King. Yeah. Oh shit. He died. Dante's dying. I think he's dead. No, he's... Whoa. He's been dead the whole time. The derpiest fucking... wings in the world. I like him. Dante's good. He can't fly? Dante. Oh, God. No, Dante! <laughs> he can fly! I hate you so much. He's like a little poop helicopter. <laughs> oh, no. Dante's fantastic. It uh, makes me like him more than you hate him. Oh, uh, he's f He can't even fly. He's a ball trailer. sack with wings. Damn, that's salty. You live in the afterlife. You live in the afterlife. You have had all this time to reconcile and figure everything out. You couldn't have said like, hey, where'd you go when I was like, when I was uh, I tried to alive. come back, but I got poisoned by yeah, the partner. Just be like, hey, you know the guy that everyone knows and is famous? Yeah, we were partners, he killed me. And stole oh, my really? music. Oh! I wrote this song for our daughter, Coco. <laughs> Let me sing it to you and swoon you. This is probably like 100 Sad, years ago bro. at this point. How did they not make up? He left. This family. Try to go home to you and Coco, but De La Cruz murdered him. How did you not know? You've had decades. She was so salty that she ignored everything he said. A child to raise and I'm just supposed to forgive you? Yeah. <laughs> you leave me alone with a child I'm supposed to forgive you. He, he killed died. me. He's oh. dead. <laughs> That's it. This poor Hector. But to be fair to her, he Hector just left. This could be lies. He went out for cigarettes. This is his, the ultimate form of coming out for cigarettes being murdered. I guess you've had so Sadness. many years to explain this. Bitter old cooch. Hector, <gasps> you don't have to forgive him, but we shouldn't forgive him. Mean, you kind of should forgive You can, can saltily remember someone. This dog. This, what? The f***ing dog in the corner. It just takes all the feels out of the entire scene when I see his <laughs> derpy ass face. If we help you get his photo, you will return home. No more music. What is their whole shit with music? They're just bitter as because I guess he died because of music, so f you, no one can do music ever again. This, none of this makes any goddamn sense. It's like the whole reason your family hates music is because you thought this guy ran away and left you to be a musician. He, but someone just f he murdered went him. Against his, against his will, and then he got murdered, and now you learned he was murdered, and you're like, okay, fine, we will help him not die. But still no music because I said so. No more music, you will make shoes. No music. You will be little poop boy that makes shoes until you are old poop boy that gives birth to more shoe making machines. If I hear you drop poop in toilet and it makes the key of G, you are out of family. <laughs> you will never fart in F sharp again. <laughs> oh, that's for murdering the love of my life. Who? Oh, she's talking about me. I'm the love of your life. I don't know. I'm still a <laughs> <laughs> typical married couple. Uh, Let's let's stand there awkwardly while he runs away. What is this guy just like a full-on mustache? I know he's a mustachio, but a full-on mustachio villain. Why did you just give the photo back? He's a bitter dick. He doesn't want anyone to find out that he's a murderer. Damn, this guy is a fucking kung fu demon. Whoa! Wow. Bone chunks. <laughs> this guy's just head. Head bonk, bonk. Oh, left. Oh, oh she's going on stage. Oh no. How strong? <laughs> Holy shit! Dante. Is that Dante? Dante is a. Yeah. He likes bones. I guess he's a dog. <laughs> or is she gonna tell everyone that he's a liar? I guess singing is the only thing that he can do. Say the message through song. Are they gonna start dancing with her? I... Oh, guitar! But she said no she music! Can, she, she can sing! She said no music! Why are they doing the music? Are they gonna perform together? Oh, this is so beautiful. I, it's so sad that a Conjuring movie is based on this. I don't think it's based on it. <laughs> La Llorona. That, that's just saying I don't know what the 
means. Is Layer on like their babysitter? I think it's a place. I don't think so. Why is it capitalized then? They're like creepy. <laughs> Not that. Yeah. I said no music. Why does he want the photo so bad? Because he wants to be not remembered as a killer. It's very simple. How would anyone believe a child that said, I went to the afterlife and I found out that my grandfather was murdered by De La Cruz. And they were like, okay, sure, get some medicine. <laughs> there's no way it's gonna work out. It, yeah, there's like 10 minutes left. And to never, never stop playing music. Forget how much your family loves you. Oh shit, Uno Reverso, baby. He gets to sing, but nope. Of course, this cocksucker's coming out of here. This bitch. You think they were just like watching him slowly creep up on the kid while they're holding out the pedal? <laughs> Not one more step. Or what? This this dude bitch. throw him off the edge. Holy shit, this guy's toxic. I've worked too hard, Hector. Too hard to let him destroy everything. He's a living child, Ernesto. Is there a way they can broadcast this to real life? How? <laughs> Radio? Whatever it takes. What the f go? Oh. He f threw his who he thought was his grandson off. Imagine he comes back and he's like, ah, oh, that was the just my next movie. The show must go on. Jesus, f yeah. How do you play this one off? He's half skeleton. This f pig with wings can't fly on its oh, own. Shit. Let alone carry this kid. Come on, big boy. Save it, big boy. Yes, let's go. He'd be dead anyways. Dante's f be dead us. regardless. Dante's like a little baby parachute. Familia. Orchestra. Orchestra. A one, a two, a one. A one, Damn. two, a, f a you. <laughs> a one, a two, a one, two, f you. Ba -da -ba 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 Tomatoes and bread. Get f bozo. It's Pepita. Dante better have the f photo or I'm disowning him. I'm disowning this f***ing rainbow ball sack. You're next, bitch. Why does this family have this gargoyle beast? Why not, Corey? They made shoes, that's the sacrifice. You have to make shoes for a hundred years to summon a, a... He just wombo comboed him. He's gonna put him down in pieces. Just embarrass him. Oh, shit! No, no not the belly oh, again! Oh, He's gonna get crushed no. by the bell again. Is, oh, what's the opposite of saved by the bell? That's f***ing beautiful. That's the opposite of sadness. Wow. Wait, is this a sad shot? What is this? No, happy. Oh, happy shot. It's oh. He better, Hector better not die, I swear. The, the photo thing has to not be a part of it. It's like in the writing, but it's a loophole because they yeah. wouldn't be able to have this holiday like a hundred years ago if it was only photos. True. Unless the, the, that's the new way to immortalize. <laughs> Cameras invented to immortalize. Oh, yeah, there's no one like that lives in this afterlife that's older than like a hundred because there's no photos. <laughs> That'd be such a terrible condition. I promise, I won't let Coco forget you. Coco's dead. <laughs> it's, been, it's been like a That'd week. That'd be so sad, dude. I guess it's only been a day. They said by sunrise. Yeah. He goes back. <laughs> one shot, one, one shot, we missed it. So he said, don't let Coco forget he's dying. But it's sad. we don't know if he died. It's sad. It's, it's still sad. sad. It's yes. sad. It's sad. It's it's the guy who's the the grandpa to the guy that he thought was not grandpa and he saved his life and then he sent him back and he's like, oh, only if you remember me and then they sang the song, remember me and then- Remember me, yeah. remember I just explained me. the whole plot. So, you know, if you skip that part and you already watched the movie, then you can ignore it, I guess. <laughs> Wait, is he going to play to Coco so she doesn't forget him? Where have you been? <laughs> Stay away, Grandma. I have more important shit to deal with. Damn, I locked the door. She's fading. My applesauce. Mama Coco, please, don't forget him. Oh, shit, this is sad, dude. This is sad. <laughs> he wanted you to have this. <gasps> oh, my music! God, the devil's music! I said no music! So the song he wrote is gonna end up saving him. This actually works in real life too. Music, yeah. People like that have Alzheimer's, they like can remember songs, but they can't remember people. And they, re they remember their emotions with the songs. Oh like, my God, music isn't evil? But I thought she wanted the no music. But I thought music equals bell, and bell kills you. I'm confused. My papa used to sing me that song. He loved you, Mama Coco. She has a photo. She in has here. a backup photo. Backup. Or she has the ripped part. She got the backup photo photo. That's his photo. 
Yes. Yes. Yeah. Let's f***ing go. It's a picture of a turd. <laughs> it's it's just... a picture of Dante. Uh, oh my God. Woo! Yes. Let's f***ing go. Yes, Coco. That's why this movie's called Coco, because Coco's a f***ing boss. She didn't do much. This entire family is like, some music He's or good. no? Music or no music? What, what do we do now? One year later, they sell shoes with music built in them. <laughs> they sell tap dancing shoes now. <laughs> That's good. Yep. Uh, no, man, no! F Coco died! She was one million years I old. I cry, Coco! It is assumed that she was dead from the beginning. Coco's so wholesome. I'm taking a shot She to was Coco. a living corpse. Coco is my girl, man. Is he gonna meet Coco? Enjoy your visit, Hector. Last night it's in. Departures? It's an airport of the beyond? Poor Coco is a gone. <laughs> Coco. She's so old, I told you. <laughs> I told you, you can't be old in a dead place. It's weird. She's older than her parents. <laughs> Wait, this this means that both the mom and dad died super young. How did the mom die? She must have died immediately after. What did he die of? He died of oh poison. He not died sausage. of poisoning. Well, Imagine somebody poisoned you and killed you and then spread a rumor that you died choking on a sausage. That's petty as shit, dude. Yeah. That's not how this shit works. Yes, it is. You are a gargantuan gargoyle beast. I like it. You can't be a cat. That's not fair. Why is Dante a little hot dog ball sack and she gets to be a panther? Because Dante is the ultimate ball sack. And Pepito. And Miguel is just swinging away. You oh. see a bell looming in the distance. <laughs> Hey, that's theft, buddy. <laughs> I wouldn't stand over the well, he's gonna die. Uh, it's things that end in E-L-L -L that kill them. Bell well. This is very good. Uh, thank you so much for watching Coco. We cried, we laughed, Coco we Bango! Cried. Also, Coco Bango! If you like this video, suck that like button. And check out our Patreon to get the full thing, the full wholesome experience the full of Coco chorizo. just blessing The full <laughs> chorizo that you'll choke on with your mighty mouth. Jesus Christ. Yeah. That sounds like a good experience. And if you don't like that, no music for you! <laughs> no!